Hey, what's up guys? I'm here with another episode of FTD Kitchen. And I'm gonna be showing you Hazel Slab. Sprinkles on my head. Sprinkles on my head. You can see um what you do is you're meant to put a bit of butter on top of it and it's like a chocolate like sprinkles that you, you put on top. This is the um, manufacturer they make it here, the Deruterer. And this one is the um, the Royal chocolate flavoured. Um, whereas you can get lots of different flavours of it. Like white chocolate, dark chocolate, um, mixed chocolate, all different sorts of flavours. N even nut one. So I'm going to give it a go. It was invented in 1936 and apparently um, over 750,000 uh, slices of bread consumed every day with it. So there you go, it's a very popular snack here. I'm going to give it a whirl. So it looks like inside. Yeah, it smells very chocolatey. It smells like stale or anything. I suppose you just like to bring it onto your toast, basically. I haven't got any butter, so I can't really do that, so I'm just going to have to make do. Like this. And that's a, it's like a breakfast. Breakfast is how, it's how you eat it. Taste it out then, not be shy. It's the first time we've tried, tried our hazel, hazel slag. Just give it a whirl. Oh. Real strong hit of it. Oh, spilling it on the floor. Proper loaded with sugar. <laughs> Make your dead up with this. Whoa. It's good though. This one's not actually sprinkles. This, that one there, it's like more sort of like, like fruit sprinkles. Yeah, that's the more traditional, traditional style of doing it. I think it's with the sprinkles. You can see they've, they've got sprinkles on there. Well, this is um, like the main manufacturer juice it here in the Netherlands so let's just give it a, keep on eating it sprinkles on my head sprinkles on my head they stick to my pillow every time I go to bed sprinkles on my head sprinkles on my head they stick to my this one was 1.99, two euros. Mm. I like it. Maybe it's a little bit too much chocolate for me in the morning. I'm gonna have to give this particular one, the um, extra chocolate, pure and think, whatever that means. Give it a hmm. Three point seven out of five. It's a bit too too much sugar for me. The chocolate's okay. It's not it's not the best best chocolate in the world though. It's not like it's Swiss chocolate or Belgian chocolate or something like that. But it's pretty good for for a breakfast cereal. Not a cereal, breakfast toast topping. 
not bad. I liked it, yeah. 3.7. Oh, yeah. Hey, okay, thanks for watching, guys. This has been an FTD kitchen review in the, the home of FTD. <laughs> so, um, stay tuned. Make sure to check out my Instagrams and tweets on the foods that I eat, eat between making these videos. I'll catch you on another review in the future. Oh, yeah.